All right, checking in. One, two, three. Hi guys, I don't know, I kind of messed up the first one, so we're trying this again. Please let us know if this is working. Hello? <laughs> Sorry, Sam. Hi. Sorry guys, my first time doing YouTube live stream, so let me know. Um, does the sound okay? Can you hear us okay? Everything's good? We muted our speakers. Okay, cool. Hello. <laughs> Hi guys. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for uh, being patient. So this is Rachel and uh, we're going to play a song for you. It's called Fire while people start streaming in and would love to know where you guys are streaming from. So give me your, oh, Mexico. Someone's from Mexico. So let us know where you're from. We're going to start with a song called Fire. All right. <laughs>
Hello from Kentucky. We are here in Hawaii and we basically just have a bunch of rain for winter and it's about 80, 80, it's 80 degrees. It is 80 bit. degrees. <laughs> Hey guys, thank you. Red is my color. Hi Daniel, nice to see you. So thanks for tuning in. Uh, this is our very first live stream on YouTube and we're doing this because you guys um, gave me 100,000 subscribers. I have the YouTube um, silver playback button which I wanna open up with you guys. Um, but before I do, I wanted to do like a Q&A. So if you had any questions regarding um, playing styles, any questions for me, any questions for Rachel. We are totally open to answering you. Um, let's see, watching from California. Hello, just came from California, was there in October. And uh, the end of this month, I'm going to Germany. I'm going to Deutschland, to Hamburg, Berlin, and then going over to the East Coast where it's just as cold. And I'll be playing, oh, from Vietnam. Hi, from Texas, from Georgia. Oh, someone wants to hear Jupiter. Okay, Eric, we are gonna play Jupiter for you next. Um, at what age did I start playing ukulele? I was five when I started. I am not gonna tell you how old I am now. And then uh, someone wants to know how we met. Um, oh, I used to DJ with her at um, the Hyatt when she had her gig at the Hyatt. And I would DJ before she played, so actually, I guess through your manager, through Mark. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mark. Through my manager. Yeah, I used to have like a weekly at the Hyatt in Waikiki, and she would DJ before and I think after mm -hmm. my my sets. And she obviously she plays amazing guitar, and so we started collaborating. Um, how would you relearn your instrument from scratch? That's a really good question. Um, if I was beginning ukulele. I would start with scales. I know that doesn't sound fun, but <laughs> you gotta start from the very beginning, the foundation. So I would start some, you know, with something like. You know, just so you get comfortable using the thumb. And then after that, I would start doing maybe like some strumming patterns. So three line by, three line by, you know, and then up, down, down, up. So start from there. Um, how do I do my strumming of Malabena? This one. Well, that took a couple years, <laughs> but um, I would just start just simple. Um, up down 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 up down 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 up down 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 up down down down. So just like simple rhythm and then after that you you can make it a little bit more i know this is so vague but it's hard to like try and tell you how to do it in like 30 seconds do i have any siblings i have one younger sister she is 22 and she's doing the college life she's a track runner do you have any siblings i don't i'm an only child only That's child a cursing a blessing and a curse, mm. and a curse. <laughs> i was an only child until i was eight Oh, and then my sister came. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, a Norway. Um, someone is asking about nails. I do. Yes, I have acrylics on one side. This I keep short because that's where you're doing the finger stuff here. And then because I play flamenco Spanish, I have the long nails. These are acrylics. Um, and then Rachel, I think you do naturally long. <laughs> <laughs> and she's got the pick. And short. And yeah. I use a pick sometimes. Yes. There you go. So um, if you have more questions, we're going to play a song for you now. So get ready with more questions. And someone asked for Jupiter. Are we single? Well, you're so personal. Um, uh, I don't know how to answer that. No, actually, I am not single. <laughs> I have been with uh, my boyfriend, who happens to be the drummer of this band. He could not be here, Jonathan, because he is snowboarding with his son. But I have a picture, because he said, put a picture. So, this is Jonathan. 
Uh, we've been together nine years. He's also the crazy percussionist. And uh, this is when we went to Australia together and uh, we hung out with a koala bear. So that's Jonathan and uh, that's me and then that's our baby koala bear. <laughs> All right, here we go. So we're gonna play a song for you now called uh, Jupiter. So I'm gonna just do Jupiter. Since I kind of messed up the first live stream, would you guys be a doll and just let people know that this is the live stream and maybe send them a link um, on Facebook, on Instagram, because the first link is to the old live stream, which I totally just did not do right. So if you could help me out, that would be great. Um, let's see what you guys have got some questions. Questions, what type of mic are you using to record the songs? I am using the Apple phone. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> Nothing fancy. Um, let's see. Oh, Mercury. Mercury is a fun one. Do you know Mercury? No, yeah. Mercury? Do you know Mercury? No. Okay. Not yet. Yeah. Oh, man. How many ukuleles do I play? Oh, yes. I will do more streaming. Don't worry. We're going to play more songs. But how many uh, ukuleles do I have? Well, do you guys want, I'll show you how many ukuleles I have. Here's one. Okay, hold on. Close the thing. Hi guys, welcome to my apartment. Here is uh, two, here's three. Let's keep going. We have four, five, six. We have one in the corner, seven. We have eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. That's a double bagger. So I think I have like, 12. <laughs> Something like that. I think I have 12. Um, but you guys keep asking for directions. Are the other instruments would you think would be fun to play? Um, I do play guitar 
and um, I just love string instruments. I play a little piano. Do I have any pets? I've always wanted a pug, and because I travel so much, I have. This is Chester, and he is my pug for the moment. Do you have any? I don't. Yeah. yeah, we live in apartments, so it's hard to have um, pets here in Hawaii. Uh, some of the musical inspirations. Ooh. I, I love Lana Del Rey. I love classical music. I love flamenco. Um, How about you? Well, I'm a DJ at, at a radio, college radio station, so I'm always listening to new music. Um, I don't know, just anything different, not mainstream. Mm. That's what I would say. <laughs> yes. Uh, let's see. Do I speak Spanish? I do not, but I can sing one Spanish song. Uh, I'm going to try. I hope you guys will like it. Just a little snippet. I learned. Como te amas, baby? Desde que te vi, supe que eras para mí. Dile a tus amigos que ando moverí. Eso lo seguimos en el after party. Con calma, ay, que el mundo le hago menea. Mueve ese pumón, girl. Ey, un asesino cuando baile, quiere que todo el mundo lo vea. That's all that I know. I'm sorry. That's the only thing that I know. I will learn more. Um, how many years did it take to learn how to play? I have been playing for 25 years. Long time. What about you? Um, let's see. To do math. 14 years. 14, 14 years. years. 25 years. And... Um, when will we come to Brazil? I want to come to Brazil. I do. I have not gone to South America yet. So I really want to go. And uh, favorite song that I've written? Hmm. Really good question. I don't know. I have to be in like a certain mood. Um, and a lot, of, a lot of you are asking if we are coming to your area. Just check my website, tamane.com. And it has a, a live, and it tells you exactly where I'm playing. But I'm going to Germany, and I'm going all over the East Coast in January. So next month, I'll be in New York, Boston, Philadelphia, Washington, D.C., and Deutschland. And then, uh, <clears throat> secretly, I am also coming to Sedona and Salt Lake City, Utah in March. It has not been promoted yet. And then uh, in the summertime, it looks like I'll be coming to Europe again. And um, I don't know. Uh, let's see. All right, we're going to play another song for you. And then I think we're going to open the, the plaque together. So we're going to play one more song, and then we're going to open the YouTube silver playback button. And uh, what do you guys want to hear? Oh, something rock. Okay, why don't we... Oh, I know. So you guys have been asking for directions. So uh, let's see, let's do something rock and then uh, at the end we'll do directions, okay? All right, so here we go. Let's do um, um, aerials. We're gonna do aerials for you. All right. Okay. Okay, and if anyone's interested, I also play with these Hercule picks when I do my crazy fast picking. I play with this.
Hi guys. Hi. <laughs> Is my lipstick okay? Yes. Um, yeah, thank you guys for tuning in. Please let other people know that this is the live stream. And um, yeah, I'm glad that you guys enjoyed it. And I think we're gonna open the silver playback button. So I just wanna say thank you for um, subscribing to my channel and having YouTube uh, send this plaque. They send it to you when you hit a milestone, like 100 subscribers all those types so are you guys ready hi nebula yeah we're gonna open it are you guys ready let's do it okay so we'll open it i know i got that <laughs> with the tape gotta be careful all right you guys oh man what? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's getting there. It's getting there, you guys. Oh. We've got a lovely letter from the CEO of YouTube. Oh, wow. <laughs> um, just saying that we did something big. Thank you, guys. Oh. Here it is. Presented to Taimani for passing 100,000 subscribers and the silver playback button plaque. Thank you, you guys, for making this happen. I'm excited to put this in my house. I got to find the perfect place, but um, thank you for having this happen. And um, yeah, we want to play some more music for you as a thank you. Um, but before we do... Do you guys have any more questions for Rachel and I? Uh, oh, Tokata. That's a good one. That's a good one. Um, hmm. Will I, will we explore, oh, these, yeah, these are real tattoos. Um, will we explore different types of music? Um, yeah. I always think I try to at least. I just go with whatever is the flow and whatever is the inspiration. At the moment, I'm writing a new album and it um, has a Polynesian vibe. I am half Samoan, thanks to my mom, hence why I have Samoan tattoos. And so, yeah, I think every album has like a different type of feel and a different type of genre. And there's always, you know, room for exploration. What about you, Rachel? Do you think you're going to explore different types of music with the guitar, or um, what do you think? Well, I enjoy playing with you, so wherever you go, I'll probably go to exploration-wise. Nice. <laughs> That's a good answer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Rachel is great. She is super open, and uh, she's an amazing player. She puts in that work ethic. You guys, Thank work you. ethic, <laughs> That's yeah, that's a big deal. you gotta put got to put in the work. There's no way around it. Um... Can we do more live streams? Well, let's do one for 200,000 subscribers, you guys. Mm -hmm. We'll do, oh, I'm so sorry. I had something in my mouth. Um, yeah, we'll do one for 200,000 subscribers. Um, how does it take you, how long does it take you to learn a song? What's your writing process? Have I heard of Fang E? Of course, Fang E, yeah. He's an amazing ukulele player and he's like seven. He's like 10, I'm sure he's like 12, I don't know. But yeah, he's amazing. He's definitely gifted and a genius. Um, all right, we're going to play, we're going to play something. How did I learn how to play? I've been playing since I was five. I've had many different types of, um, ukulele teachers and, uh, I've practiced a lot. So do I have a thousand dollars for your little sister, Megan? No, I do not. I'm sorry, <laughs> but Hey, you might as well ask, right? All right. We're going to do directions for you. And, um, yeah, we're actually going into the recording studio after this. So, yeah. Okay. Ah, and a bunch of you are asking, can I do some tutorials? You know, to be honest, I don't write, I don't read music. So it's a little hard for me to like figure out how to teach tutorials. But I have taught some, which I have on my YouTube channel already. But it's all done by ear. So I got to figure some ways to teach you guys tutorials with just, I've, I've, I learned by ear. So if you don't read music, don't despair. It does make things a lot easier, but um, 
I just, I listen, I do everything by ear. And how many hours a day do I practice or do you practice? Like an hour, like an hour a day, an hour every other day. Mm -hmm. I mean, usually it's like, you know, throughout the week, not every day, like, you know, three, yeah. four times, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, depending if we have like a performance coming up. If we have a performance, then we're like, yeah, before it. Oh, between the bars. Okay, I'll do between the bars, and then we're going to go into directions. Um, a Hawaiian song. Well, it's by Nako Bear, turned into a Hawaiian translation. Here we go, you guys. So <clears throat> I'll do between the bars, and then I'll figure out how to get into it.
it's called directions for you. And uh, any more questions before we um, go? What do you think makes the ukulele unique and challenging? What motivated you to, what motivated you to play the ukulele? Um, well, the ukulele is a very interesting instrument. It is originally from Portugal and was brought over to the islands of Hawaii. And uh, they created something called an ukulele. And uh, most of them are made from a native Hawaiian wood called koa wood. Um, and then they change the tuning. So it's a very hybrid type of instrument. It's fun to play. It's easy to take around. And it's also somewhat, uh, what's the word? It's kind of like the underdog. Like when you say you play ukulele, most people are like, oh, cool. You know, and then it has so much potential. You can do so much with it. And uh, that's why I love playing it. And I play a little guitar, but my first love is the ukulele. When did I learn to dance? And what is my favorite wood for ukulele? My favorite wood for ukulele is um, cedar because it's warm and my playing is a bit crazy, as you can tell. There's a lot going on. So cedar kind of like mellows the sound out, me mellows the trebliness of the ukulele. So um, this one though, this one was made on Kauai, the island of Kauai. This is actually koa wood. So this is a native tree. And uh, what this is what most ukuleles are made out of. And it's gorgeous. It's This one's custom made. Um, this was inspired by my tattoo. <laughs> uh, any tips and tricks to defeat stage fright? That's a good question. What do you do to um, defeat stage fright? Um, well, you know, I mean, I guess probably for you and I, we've been doing it for a while. So I think just doing it a lot or, you know, just doing it and um, experiencing and going through that stage fright helps a lot. And you know, after a while, it's just not even really a thing. Yeah, I, I totally agree. Yeah. I used to get so scared that I would have stomach issues before I would go on stage. But I was playing in Uncle Don Ho's show in Waikiki every week. And so I'd say after a month, it started going away. So you just have to, I know, you just have to get on stage and do it as much as possible. And maybe a glass of wine before doesn't hurt either. <laughs> if you're over 21, a glass of wine. Or if you're European, if you're over 14, if you're European. <laughs> um oh okay um all right you guys uh thanks for tuning in do you have anything to say no well congratulations on oh. your award i'm really thank proud you. of you <laughs> thanks rachel thank you you guys for making that happen yet again we unboxed <laughs> the beautiful silver playback button thanks to you guys and uh we'll do another live stream for you if we can hit 200,000 subscribers. So um, make sure you guys help out with that. And thank you for tuning in. This is Rachel Look. Um, my name is Taimane. And uh, check out my website because I do tour a lot. So I might be around your area. Thanks for tuning in. Thank you guys. And I will see you guys later. Aloha. Bye. Cheehoo.